everybody, welcome to my first part of my British uh, fascist let's play, playing as the British Empire, 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 led by Oswald Mosley, the leader of the British of Union fascist. We're gonna try to like, uh, you know, help Germany out a bit, and uh, you know, try to take out France as quickly as possible. Well, we'll, we'll take our time. But the first thing that I want to get to do is try to invade Ireland. See that? See, a while ago they decided to break free from uh, from the British Empire. So I'm planning on quickly changing that. Oh, uh, a whole bunch of they left our faction. Eventually we'll get back in Canada. Eventually, but like. Right now, I'm planning on, like, uh, planning on uh, going after Ireland. That's kind of, uh, our objective right now. And, oh, we should also get to, uh, our research. We don't really need, uh, guns right now, but we should work on tank, like, the, the victory. And some, like, technical computing. And, uh, also, also our land doctrines. Yes, this is a... A very important part of our strategy. Right now, we're on the Grand Battle Plan Doctrine, and uh, you should work on that part. And uh, hmm, what should we do next? That was gonna hurt. All right, we're already gonna try to get our uh, fighters to do start doing some exercises. We want to start like uh, getting them up to scratch. Bombers. Yeah. You want to get them all up to uh, exercising. All right. I'm um, about our troops. Who should we put in charge? And Richard O'Connor. Alright. Oh, we should also get done, like, uh, some, like, training of our troops. Like, let's get them, like, training up. We should uh, also work on our equipment production. We should, uh,. Also, let's put together some military factories. Like in here, in here. And also civil factories. That also help out a bit. And also work on some of our tanks. And also, and along with, and uh, uh, and also we should, uh, we also should get some, uh, some theorists. Oh, and we should work on our focus tree. We have a few options here. Steady as she goes. Weekly stability. Oh, I don't want democracy. Reinforce the empire. Hmm. Um, yeah, I should go for reinforce the em. Mm. Yeah, I'll go for limited rearmament. I should do. All right. Training. We want to get them up to uh, regular. Regu uh, up to regular. Also, get them up to regular. Uh, all right. Maybe I could. Uh, I'm good. Eh. And soon the Spanish Civil War might just break out, and we're gonna ha want to help the nationalists. Uh, tra Francisco Franco to try to take out the Republicans. Oh no! King George the Fifth dies, and we might want to go. Well, eventually we're gonna have to face up against France. Eventually. All right. Now that they're in position. All right. Let's begin justifying against them. Yeah. Oh, that's ready. Uh, we should. Uh, oh, Alright, so how is this training going so far? Eh, we should, oh, we should get there pretty soon. 
And also, uh, also we, uh, we're gonna have to get some, uh, also, maybe we should, oh yeah, we should try to go take out, like, Siam or something. It'll give us, like, an easy pathway open to, like, Indochina. Oh, oh, we can also just cross from, like, British Raj or something. Like that. We're gonna want to start boosting, uh, fascism in, like, British Raj in South Africa. Alright, uh, since we already know that. Also, okay, so how long until we end or finish justifying? Yeah, 250 days. How about we play like. Yeah, that's some good music. Alright, so. Oh, we should also do some naval exercises. Yeah, we've got doing, doing some naval exercises. That'll slowly get us some XP. Oh, what about our oil problem? Hmm. We just want a bit of oil. Oh, look! Look. Germany just remilitarized the Rhineland. Alright, um, also, alright, since we have an oil problem, we should go after Saudi Arabia. They have like three oil, and we have tons of borders with them, so it should be easy enough to take them out. Since we do, you know, before we have, but after we take out Ireland. Okay, right, what next focus should we Right, so now we can go, we can go down. Industrial stuff right here, and a bunch of this stuff right here. But like, we could also, uh, you know, do stuff with like the Commonwealth and that kind of stuff. And also, uh, home defense. We could try to secure Iraq, hmm. and secure Iran. Uh, I kind of lots of this stuff is mainly uh, democratic, but let's try to reinforce the empire. like, uh, 150 more days to go. So, like, what my plans are is to take out Ireland, maybe, like, take Saudi Arabia, like, try to join the Axis, and, uh, maybe we can, uh, and we, and we can, like, uh, eh, I don't really think we need the Allies anymore. Hmm. Alright. We don't really need the allies anymore. I think we're gonna dismantle... We're gonna dismantle... Nah, we'll keep it around for a while. Alright, so... How are we doing? Oh, we're almost dead to... Also, Mosley questions Irish sovereignty. Who determines the borders of a nation and how are they determined? Whatever people may have found the past to justify where British Empire needs for where British Empire, I think it's supposed to say where the British Empire ends and Ireland begins. So, alright, so soon we're gonna be alright, now that we're nearly done uh, training up some of these uh, pilots. Regular. I need to train these guys though, they're rookies. Okay, I think. Okay. Oh, alright, now that they've taken Ethiopia. So, how's our naval exercises going? We 
You don't need that anymore. Yeah. We can stop training for now. Alright, uh, we're almost just about, we have like a couple hundred days until we're done just playing against Ireland. We should uh, now look towards, uh... Hmm. Oh, I think now we have like a bunch of political power and we should look at what we can do now. And the Burma Road. Okay. Almost. Well, we should also look at some more uh, ship production. We want to have a really big navy. Hmm. And maybe we could build some. Of those. We want to have a really big navy. Alright, I want to build some more uh, planes and stuff. First we need to stop this uh, negative equipment before we can start building us uh, a big army. And, uh, oh, how are those uh, exercises going? I know that now that a bunch of them are up to regulars. Oh look, the Spanish Civil War. We should. Oh no, that's not some of that stuff. Is done. All right, we we'll stop all this training now. Oh, we should send some volunteers over to National Spain. Oh, maybe like an armored division. We could use. We should send like an armor division over to them. And, uh, you want some like volunteers? All right. Now that's ready. Send them some volunteers. Oh, we're almost done justifying against uh, Ireland. Oh, history's done. But, all right, we should service overseas. The next one: army experience, naval experience, air experience. Um. Oh, uh, we should. Hmm. We can we can fortify a bunch of stuff. We want to. Uh, we don't want, we want to, uh, work along with Germany. And soon they should, uh, oh, alright, now that they've arrived, we gotta, alright, now that they've arrived in here, we should send them over here and try to push towards Madrid. We're gonna try to capture Madrid. So I think we should be able to take this area with enough soldiers. And I think once we take Madrid, this will be much easier from there. Alright. Let's over there. Oh, we also have more research slots. We should look towards, uh, construction one. And, uh, Air doctrines, like oof, they're like air superior. All right, I got the soldiers are almost there. Let's go. All right. So how's these uh, training? Here? Oh. All right. I think that those guys are done. They're all up. They're both up to regular now. They're all up to regular. So, these guys do. Alright, we should... Let's get them to, uh, train a bit. Alright. Now that... Alright, we almost got our divisions over there. We're gonna just push towards some drift. These are gonna, like, our tough light... This was a light tank division. Not the best tank division, but... Yeah, it's okay. There's two... Alright, push towards there. Oh, 
they just did it in a circle. Alright, now that that's pretty. We're almost done justifying against Ireland. Maybe we should go to uh, go for, go against Saudi Arabia or Yemen. Maybe. Computing. All right, now we got another research slot. Hmm. Nuclear technology. How about uh, yeah, anti-tank. That should do. All right. So how's this fighting going? We're over rushing towards Madrid. This up a bit. How's their training going? Oh, they're almost up to regular. That should help us a bit. How's uh, this uh, doing? Those will move. Alright. Or. So close towards justifying just a couple more days. Okay. Oh, I think a oh, great. We have a few too many divisions. Alright, we're gonna try to take Madrid. Almost there. Oh look! Stalin's murdering people! As usual. Yeah, we're almost there. Okay, we've got like a hundred more days to go. Okay, we're likely gonna break the Next country we should go for is probably Saudi Arabia. Maybe Afghanistan. Oh yeah, probably Siam is probably the one I'm gonna go for. Okay, how's that doing? Oh, we're almost pushing towards Madrid. We should probably start to work towards some medium tanks. Alright, oh, we're about to capture Madrid! And, oh, we've just captured Madrid. A bit of a turning point. Okay. Oh, we're gonna have to get to their new capital, Barcelona. We should try like an, a massive encirclement. Let's send them over here to try to encircle. Let's get this all right. How are they doing? Oh, they're all at regular. Okay, let's just let them rest there for just uh, let's, let's let them regenerate just a little bit. Meanwhile, let's get back to trying to encircle the Spanish. Hopefully, we'll let this. Uh, the nationalists cover our flanks as we try to advance up here. Try to cut them off, and it'll be a really big help to the war effort if we can encircle this really large group of uh, Republicans here. Alright, let's we'll just do a save real quick. And. Uh, Attack them again. Alright, we're almost ready to, to use that war goal. Oh. Alright, let's just declare war now. And hopefully, this will be Launcher attack. I 
think we should be able to take him out. Oh. You don't want my divisions? Let's send them up. Alright, let's try that again. Oh, we need to be at peace to send volunteers. Uh. Yeah, I'm sure we'll do it soon. Oh no, they pushed back our encirclement. Bloody hell. We're gonna have to do that again. Oh no, King Edward abdicates. Alright, let's take this, and take that, and take that, and it. There we go. Now let's send them those more, more of those volunteers. Oh no. The US pursues interventionist policies. The peace movement in the United States have suffered a severe setback as Congress passed a joint resolution granting President Franklin Delano Roosevelt to use military forces necessary to safeguard American interests around the world. Oh god. This might be a slight problem. Oh, I have an idea. Let's do that. Return of the King. Didn't he just abdicate? Hmm. There is. It is no secret that the love is lost between King George uh, the Fourth and the British Union of Fascists. Um, eh, and voices in Parliament are now calling for his resignation in favor of his exiled brother, King Edward. I don't even know what that is. Is the man? Uh, is this is the man less foreign to idea of unity through strength and <laughs> a man with vision for England? His are the qualities we seek in the leader of our nation. For the sake of the empire, we must rule. Hmm. Hmm, we could... Uh, this is an interesting idea. Hmm. He could rule. Hmm. This is an interesting decision. Hmm. A turn. All right. So he can become the, our leader. R removes national spirit, King George the. Um, and King Edward becomes the leader of the fascist party, inexperienced. He's an inexperienced imperialist. He... Oh, he makes us... Alright. Uh, okay, I think that we're gonna keep... I think we're gonna keep Oswald. I think we're gonna keep Oswald. Right, uh, uh, yeah, we're gonna keep Oswald instead of Mosley. We're gonna, th we're gonna keep Oswald. That would be a unique- oh, alright. Alright, let's go do this- let's go finish this encirclement. Let's go do this- let's go do an encirclement. Ever since I left, I- Oh man, I seriously, this is a, this was a bad decision to just let the Spaniards, the Republican uh, nationalists, to leave. All right, let's begin the encirclement again. Hopefully, they'll cover my flanks. Do that again.
One last push. And... And almost there. And... Uh, so close. And... Oh, you just encircled both of them. Well, this might just turn the tide of the war significantly in the Nationalist's favor. Now they've lost, like, a bunch of divisions. Finish mopping them up, and we'll probably do another encirclement. Okay, now that's dealt with. Yay, we have Ireland's part of us now. You want Northern Ireland? Sure. Now you are Ireland. Oh God, I need you want Northern Ireland? Well, then I want you. Alright, now that they're all dead. Now that, now that the Spanish are all dead, this significantly will turn the war in our favor. Now, first of all, we. Alright, where should we focus n uh, our efforts now? Over here in the north to try to take their new capital, or in the south. And we'll probably try to, uh, to you know, cut them off. Okay. Yay! Encirclements! Alright, now that's getting ready. We should probably maybe go against, like, Saudi Arabia or something. We don't have that many divisions. Look. Alright, now we should start- oh, we should start working towards medium tank. Oh, and the Churchill. That'll do. We should start building some better mm, bombers, maybe. What about our land doctrine? Let's prepare to defend. Yeah, all right. I'm gonna build go for improved inventory equipment. Alright, so now that we've completely cut off this area from the rest of Spain, it'd be a bit easier to take them out. Alright, so Italy's taken Ethiopia. It's 1937. We should go after Siam. I don't think they have that many divisions. Oh no, the humanity! The Hindenburg crashed! We should work to our next goal, maybe capturing, capturing their capital. Alright. Oh, let's encircle them! Let's want another encirclement! Yay, another encirclement. Oh! Yay, the Spanish Civil War ended! We just we succeeded in spreading fascism. All right, next target we should probably go for Siam or something like that. Let's, oh, maybe we should invade Canada. Oh, oh but the U.S. will probably get intervene. Will probably in, intervene. Alright, uh, we should maybe go, alright, we're, we're eventually gonna have to go to war with America, eventually. We should, uh, work towards building us some infantry divisions. Alright, like, in the low Gloucester Shire. Uh, Shire. Uh, sure, I think the British pronounce it's it, it said Shire, but I, for British people usually pronounce it Shire, like Yorkshire. 
still work for some tank gates. eventually customizing division templates. Alright, what focus should we do next? Cruise the colonial link, research speed, Mediterranean bastion. I don't really want to go to war with Italy. Maybe we should go after Denmark. Okay, mm, I don't know. We should probably go after Denmark. Yeah, that might be a great, good idea. Hmm. Who should we do next? Oh, li Liberia. Maybe we go for Liberia. Maybe we could change that thing around from being the one nation that was um, the one nation that wasn't colonized. Sorry, the sorry Ethiopia. Uh, to zero nations that are being colonized because all nations must be colonized. Disappears. Yeah, that should do. Okay, now that we re we've managed to secure fascism in Spain, maybe we should go for the Middle East. Get uh, help with our oil, uh, with oil, and maybe we're going to secure our colonies. It's really a uh, just like. New Zealand and Australia just kind of broke up and broke apart from us. And, and uh, we're probably gonna have to go to war with America if we want to get to Canada. Denmark is likely our best next option. Yeah, we don't really need to go to war with Liberia. Alright, we should. Oh, we should probably. They should probably get training. And eventually, we're gonna have to go to war with France. Alright, since division templates are looking pretty good, we should plan for Denmark. That'd be a pretty good idea. Hmm, should we do it? Hmm. Uh, probably, uh, how many divisions do you think they have? All right, we're gonna plan for. All right, we're planning for Denmark. All right, we're gonna. We're, all right, since I turned on free war goals, this should uh, only take us. Uh, not a while, we don't have any world tension limits or any of that crap. We just have good old, uh, just uh, simple uh, justifications. We can, and we can also easily be able to seize like Greenland and Iceland. So, like that. Oh, we got our Matildas. I want to work towards medium tanks, like. The Alright, now that 
that's done. Let's go for uh, special air service. We can go for that. Naval rearmament. Or air rearmament. Hmm, go to uh, motorized army. We'll go for a special air service. Yeah, that'll do. We need. Oh, and. Uh, uh, we don't really. We need to stop. We don't. We aren't gonna justify against them anymore. We're gonna justify against Denmark. <laughs> and, uh. We're gonna do for some naval invasion sports. <laughs> Okay, it looks like we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna go for some naval invasion support. Uh. Okay, we're all gonna just go we're gonna gonna go for naval We're gonna cancel that. We're gonna go for an evil vision from here. Down to there. I don't even know what's going on. This is a bit complicated. Alright, now that we got those five divisions there. Alright, this should, uh. Let me take a bit. Alright, now that we go. Alright. I wish. I really wish we could just speed it up. And now. Uh, maybe sometime else I'll turn on, like, the instant war goal command. And we should also use these com uh, political points. Alright. Air service done. Oh, that's ready. Uh, go for another. Another one of these. Hmm. We should go for some of that. Alright, but it's only like one four tier, so that's basically what we're gonna have to do. Insignition. Okay, this is gonna. This is annoying. And I need. Why don't I have enough naval? Uh, naval in the area. <laughs> We're gonna have to find our way. <sighs> Pissing me off. Why can't move my soldiers there? Why can't? I'm literally going to have to. They are just going to start death. They are going to start. Uh, I guess we'll have to make like a race to the dock to get supplies. 
This is really pissing me off. Alright, we're gonna... Um, yeah, it's just... Because, like, for some reason I can't get my navy over there without it saying I can't. And why is there red there? I don't get what's going on. Alright, we're gonna have to land here and just race for... And just try to, like, race for the... Race, uh, race for... Uh, just try to race for the dock. And if that fails, well, uh... Well, we're screwed. And we're gonna have to find out that that was a very bad option. Alright, we should... And also, we should start getting our battle plans together for... by getting them trained up. Alright, let's send some more infantry over there. We're gonna go they're gonna go over to Iceland. They're gonna go from there. All right, we're gonna go for their territories and their colonies and all that stuff. Mm -hmm. Now that that's ready. Air defense. We're gonna have to uh, go for a grand assault. And we should do construction too. Go for some more military factories and some sit and some infrastructure. And uh, once we go to war with Denmark. We're gonna just- we're gonna try to land here, and we're gonna just try to bolt for their stuff. Try to bolt to the- bolt to the port. Oh, maybe I should work on, like, my paratroopers. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we should do that. We, we should, you know, we should do that. Alright, so. What, oh, we should work on our national focus. Hmm. Develop the Raj. Indian independence. <laughs> no! We're planning to go to war with Denmark, but I'm going to have to end it right here. Since this video is going on for way too long, it's gone on for like 44 minutes. So I'm going to have to say this is uh, the end of this video, but hopefully you'll watch for uh, part two. If you like the video, it only it literally takes like one one click to subscribe uh, to like or subscribe. Hey, it's your choice, though. This is, uh, anyway, this is Mr. Lime. Uh, hope you enjoy. Goodbye!